And fellow high school coach Rob Mendez tries to do the same thing. The Francis Parker offensive coordinator just looks a little different. He has no arms, no legs, and he sits in a wheelchair. But just as his new book titled Who Says I Can't points out, Mendez can overcome almost anything to accomplish his goals. Fox 5 Neighborhood All-Stars, powered by your San Diego County Toyota dealers. I was born this way, so I think, you know, I was blessed to be able to live with a purpose and show people um, that life is about perception. And I think that when you really focus on your, your, um, your abilities instead of your disabilities, life can be great. The 33-year-old just started his first season calling plays for the Francis Parker offense. Born with an extraordinarily rare condition called Tetra Amelia Syndrome, Mendez knew he wanted to have sports in his life. At first, he thought he might go into broadcasting. The competitor in me wanted to get a, be a part of a team, so um, here I am coaching football, and it's a great sport to coach with your mind because a lot of it, I feel like, is, is all mental. I write with my mouth, so I use this uh, stylus, and I do a lot of my football plays. Coach Rob, as he's known, says his love for football began in high school in his hometown of Gilroy near San Jose. After graduating at the age of 18, his coaching career began as the offensive coordinator of his high school's freshman team. Now with his sixth team and 16th season coaching football, Coach Rob cruises up and down the sidelines in his custom made chair. We're adjusting. I wouldn't say it's a straight shot dead speed fast, but it actually is, is pretty uh, quick. It's got a, it's got a cool radi <laughs> turning radius right here. What's the max speed? Only like eight or nine, but we'll say like 12 on camera. <laughs> <laughs> that sense of humor quickly endeared Mendez to his new players. When you look at him, he, he looks like, to the eye, it's a bit different, but once he gets on the field and um, he gets in his rhythm and he's just, he's yelling, he's coaching, he's teaching, um, you don't even notice the wheelchair, you don't even notice any of those things. Mendez says he aspires to become a head coach, and he's also started his own business as a motivational speaker and writer. His first book, called Who Says I Can't, tracks his life through the emotional and physical challenges that he has overcome and continues to attack. We're all here for one purpose, which is to get a CIF championship, if not a state championship. So I, I really admire the boys to really just push that aside. And, and sometimes they'll you know, be helping me with a drink and they'll give me something and they're expecting me to grab it from them. And it's actually pretty funny because they forget about it. And uh, I think that's one of the the coolest parts about coaching um, high school football is really showing people, I call it a different ability because I think we all have disabilities so we got to somehow kill that word. So with my different ability it really exemplifies to the younger freshmen, sophomores, as well as the seniors that you know what, life is perception and you got to use your mind in it. That's a very good perspective. If you know of an all-star in your neighborhood like Coach Rob, please let us know. Visit our website, fox5sandiego.com, click on sports, and then nominate a neighborhood all-star. You can also nominate through our Fox 5 app. Coach Rob's book comes out tomorrow, and you can find it on Amazon.com. He'll also have a book signing in Little Italy on Saturday, September 25th from 9 a.m. to 2 p.m. And you talk to him, and you're, you just get motivated yeah. because he is so motivational and so inspirational. It was great talking to him. And all the lessons that those young young men and mm -hmm. anyone around him are learning that they don't even realize yet. Yes, I Just did. by the nature of who he is. You realize how, how fortunate you are in any situation that you're in when you uh, work with different people of, of different abilities, yeah. as he likes to call them. That's a great uh, way to put it. Loved yes. it. Yes. Loved it. All right. Thank you.